Hey, this is Aaron from Cantina Creative. Today in this tutorial, we'll be going over how to use Adobe After Effects for feature film compositing. Let's go. Here's a before and after of what we'll be making in this tutorial. Let's go back in time to set up our example scenario. We've been approved to start work on a VFX shot for a feature film. We've had a call with the VFX supervisor who has relayed important information about the shot and the collaborative vision of the director and the production team. Here's an example of what we could have been looking at on that call. It is an editorial reference clip, which is our first look at how the shot plays out with temp graphics and rough set extension work already done quickly by the editorial team. This reference will be used for lots of things. It will be used first to help with bidding so that we know the total length of the shot and the amount of work needed to complete it. It will be used for testing our color pipeline. It will also be used for timing of any animated elements or even to double check the sync of multiple VFX plates. In our case, the newscaster element that we'll be adding. Here's what was discussed on that call. The shot needs extension work. Unfortunately, it was filmed without a green screen and the director would like to have a window to the outside world behind the actor to really open up the scene. We need to replace the graphics. The onset playback graphics are no longer being used and we need to add several 3D objects, some CG astronaut figures and a few CG books to fix some continuity errors with other shots in the scene. The director would also like to see something in the foreground, like a plant in the lower screen right, to help hide the busy area of the frame and add more depth to the scene. They've also requested that the shot feel a bit more atmospheric and moody without any specifics on how they want to do it. With all that info, let's take it away. To conquer this shot, we'll need to 3D track the plate, selectively roto certain regions, then start layering in the set extension elements, screen graphics, newscaster footage, and 3D renders of the astronauts and books before we can add some finishing touches to bring the shot to life. We'll be speeding right through some of the topics like Roto, knowing that there's already a plethora of tutorials out there. I've intentionally made this tutorial using almost all effects that come pre-installed with Adobe After Effects. However, I do use Video Copilot's FX console, which is a free plugin, to speed up the application of effects. The only other third-party plugin used is for degraining the plate, and that's called Neat Video Reduce Noise. Let's begin. 